Good morning everyone. Today I'm doing a review on these two grills. The first one is the commercial bargain grill and the second one is the Titan distribution grill. Basically the same grill, you know. It's not, not that much different. The only difference is that this one is more, uh, the structure is weaker than this one. This one uh, structure is actually stronger. As you can see on the legs and on the wheels, the Titan distribution is actually a stronger grill than this one. It's the way that the metal stainless steel is actually manufactured also and bent. This one is riveted versus this one is all welded. And it's actually a stronger uh, structure than this one is. This one feels like weaker than this one does. The legs, they mount with bolts on this one, on the Titan, versus this one right here with the bargain. The legs, they slide into this uh, piece right here. Then actually bolt on. The only thing holding right here is these three screws holding that bracket and then the legs, they slide into this bracket. Uh, the problem that I had with this one was that the motor and the rod, they don't slide in properly. As you can see, it's too short. So this rod has to be longer to be able to fit into the motor. Uh, the motor is a pretty sized motor. It's actually bigger than the one from the Titan, but it has, it, you know, it, it does the same thing. Uh, that's the problem that I'm having right here. This one, that's the groove where this bracket is supposed, to, the, the rod end is supposed to hook into the bracket, but you see how short it is? So it's short about a half inch. So that's why I'm returning this one back. The charcoal tray <clears throat> is pretty decent, pretty heavy. It's actually the strongest thing that I've seen in this grill is the charcoal tray. Uh, doesn't have any handles like this one does. This one is lighter, but it has handles. And they hook into this uh, actually bracket right here. It doesn't have any airflow on this one. The only thing that has airflow is that little piece right there versus this one right here. It has three holes right here for airflow. Uh, same size. This one is a little bit taller. I mean, taller than this one is. It's not that much. Maybe, see the difference? Maybe about two, three inches different. Uh, same, uh, same rod end. This one feels stronger than this one does. And it's a different way of uh, mounting. As you can see, that's how this um, rod hooks into this motor versus this one is just sitting in there. So this one, this one is not going to actually come off unless you bring the motor with it. All right. Uh, this concludes the video. Uh, the price on this one on the Titan distribution is $449. Versus on that one is $429. I got them both from eBay. Uh, free shipping. Uh, like I say, you know, it's not that bad. You know, <clears throat> I actually contacted the manufacturer and tell them that this grill was not going to work for me because of that issue that I have with that um, with the rod. Uh, and they sent me the the returning uh, labor. So I'm about to return this today and I'm keeping this one. This one is actually a stronger grill than this one is. It's a little bit shorter, like I said, about three inches shorter than this one, but it's, it looks way stronger. It looks way better than this one does. So if you're looking for a grill, I recommend the Titan distribution. Uh, price is $449 on eBay. And it came within three days, I got it, you know, I got it delivered to my house. Same thing with this, you know, this one delivers in about three or four days. Uh, that's, that's about it. And hope you enjoyed the video and little information about these grills if you're thinking about buying one. Have a good day.